everybody. Today I will show you how to create box in many ways. Uh, maybe this is very simple tutorial and uh, simple object box, but uh, also these ways I will, I will show you might be inspiration for you to modeling in common. So have a look. The first and uh, the quickest way to make box is just to select the box and then place it somewhere just like that or place the, the same box in specific pl a specific place for example in uh, from zero coordinate system so which will be uh, which will be first uh, point will be zero you can write it here and confirm by enter and then you can write uh, dimensions for example let's, let's let it be 50 millimeters you look at this here and you're writing here 50 millimeters confirming enter and then you just doing the last for example 40 millimeters and you've got box which dimensions are 50 50 and 40 uh, it's good to remember that when you're creating uh, 3d objects always it's, uh, mm, it's arranged that if it's created x y z that direction so uh, remember that so if you creating box just a simple way it's always zero x enter y uh, enter and z enter that, that's the first and the simplest way uh, another way to create box is to create the basics base for example base can be for example the, just a plain line uh, here or just a square rectangle if you want so let's start with the rectangle and the same we can start anywhere in the space here like this or we can specify where you want to start where I want to start I always start from zero point so now I will start from zero point and the dimensions will be 40 enter 40 enter and I'm, I'm I have re rectangle so now on one thing I need is just to extrude this uh, rectangle in specific and uh, uh, size so let's find extrude extrude curve is here yeah. you have to you can see when you just place the pointer under the icon there is uh, help command appearing and then just select enter and then write 40 and this is the, f the second way of creating uh, box another one uh, is to create line by line so look I create line uh, from zero point holding shift and pr uh, pressing tap and releasing them both and then for example 40 in one direction and then again shift and tap 40 and again shift and pressing tab 40 and you can finish at starting point it, it, the loop will be closed so uh, the comment will automatically stop um, that was a little bit tricky uh, because I have been using uh, shift and tab the shift it's the same thing what auto it means that when you press auto here or press shift on the, your keyboard that will be the same and tap it's something which blocks one direction which block one direction all right so you we've got a rectangle made line by line and now you just need to do the same thing for example you can uh, extrude it here 
but won't be with cups without cups or you can extrude here 40 if you write minus 40 it will be extruded in a different direction look minus 40 so this is also quite uh, good information to use minus if you want to extrude in a minus uh, coordinate system axis all right this is the second point uh, you can also now create for example another one another line from zero point but instead of going somewhere you can you just can change your view and then create for example let's create something else uh, like a 60 in here with shift you place your uh, your pointer vertically and then you're creating just line you see and all what you can do right now it's totally different than extruding uh, and is you can find it here this is sweep one rail so you can sweep this shape by this line you will see you can also see what's comment what to do right now on the top the always the rhino always a uh, prompt you help comments if you don't know what to do you can have a look here okay the rail for me is that one and the cross section curves is that one and you just press enter and you've got the you've got the first uh, four walls and you just need to cap it right now cap it's a comment which will close your box you can look you can find a cap uh, where a which is uh, here and it's automatically cap this is quite good and quick uh, but you can also cap I just move a little bit uh, backward you can also cap by just look at this creating surface from four corners so the but to cut your corners to snap the corners you have to be you have to have a, a snapping uh, all snap turned on here like that and then you just can find ends you can just select ends and then one end second end third and fourth end and you've got cup and the same you do here one end second end fourth end and this is it but the difference is this uh, um, the surfaces are not joined together the and uh, out there well, the ones no automatic to, co to connect them so you can as, as you can see when you select them they are separately so you can just select all of the surfaces and then join it um, okay what else we can do there is uh, also another way for example you can make a surface let's make a surface from uh, zero point and then and the same with how you did with the uh, uh, rectangle just pressing shift pressing tap and releasing them both writing dimension and then again shift tap writing dimension enter and then again shift tap writing dimension and enter and look you've got a uh, surface right here and now we can extrude this surface and this is something dif uh, different than extruding a curve extruding surfaces are here you see look and then just selecting surface and then writing on the top here writing the size or more and pressing enter and you've got box so 
basically this is uh, these comments I showed you are very often used to creating any object uh, in and uh, only your imagination and only the level of advancing of your project is uh, important and and actually very important lesson out of this tutorial is that you can create something or you can make uh, some objects in many ways so it's also mean that if you cannot make something in one way you can find the best way or you can find the way the uh, only one way sometimes you stuck somewhere in the middle of modeling and you don't know so it's it's good to know that you have a couple of uh, ways to do something so this is actually it i could uh, probably find uh, another couple of ways to create a box but there's no point you can find it out and i'm sure after these tutorials you will be um you will feel more more flexible with creating uh, primitives and, and objects okay thank you very much this is it